growing up, you were always into music. When did you realize that you had a passion? When were you when did you realize you were passionate about music? See, thing is, I'm I'm gonna be real. Like I've been engineering, man. Like, I, I learned how to engineer at six. Like that's my first time me being in the studio. And my pops like just over me, like making sure, like, hey, you know, making sure you ain't he he's test me. Like you ain't got like you you can't move that hook over to the second verse. You can't do that. Like you know, I used to surprise him, like because I used to really pay attention and like I really know how to engineer, like. Multiple man, I done engineered so many artists. Like in my time being in Tampa, like they'll tell you, like OG, oh, they'll tell you, like yeah, Shouter was like it know with us. Like when y'all get ready for bed, y'all get ready for school. This nigga, this young nigga, he was really like <laughs> getting it in. You know what I'm saying? So it's like I really said, like I've been, I've been had the passion, but far as in me wanting to like go full force, I probably say I was about like nine. That was when I wrote my first like. Rap like all right, I'm, I'm like I'm gonna write my rap. And I used to always write to my mama, and my mama understood it because I used to be mad in a way. So I used to rap like kind of like I used to rap like mad, like speaking my pain. So my mama used to actually like listen to me. nobody else ever really like sat down and was like let me. But uh, and my dad at first he was like nah you can't write. He had my uh, big bro. Matter of fact, he's from Tampa. Sway with Ty. A lot of people don't even know this. Sway with Ty wrote my first song. And Sway with Ty is also Tom G's little brother, like blood brother. Like I say, I grew up in that circle. Like I grew up in like the spot, like that spotlight crew. I was in that circle as a kid. So I got to see a lot. I got to be around a lot. I got to, when they getting ready for Cushman's and all that back in the day, I was the one like, man, can I go? Can I go? Can I go? They're like, man, hell no. Hell. To it now it's like, like I can actually probably perform and do my thing for me, you know, that ain't nothing though, but you know what I'm saying? Not to get off the topic, but just saying like, so he was trying to write a song for me. And my dad was like, and I, you know, I used to be mad because I was like, man, I, I, Pops, I can do this. Like, shout out, like, I, I, I'm really like that. I can do this to where, you know, he like, man, nah. So I just went out my way to start writing on my own, writing on my own, getting in the studio on my own time. And not waiting for my Pops to, to where I'm like, man, I'm going to show him. That was one thing, you know, with this, I always was, I mean, I want my pops to be like, man, like my son really can do it. Like, you know, I'm not going to lie, like that was something big for me. I wanted to be like, hey, pops, like, man, look at this song. And my pops be like, oh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? To where now it's like my plan worked out. Like, I just went on my own time. Like, all right, I'm going to shoot. I'm going to get videos by myself. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to get for real with it. And he was the first person to actually put me in the booth on my 13th birthday party, like, I mean, my 13th birthday, I ain't have no party. He was like, for your birthday, you gonna record your first song. So that's why I say, Sway Ty wrote me a song. I had to have that song. I had to rememberize the song and know how to do it by the time my birthday came. My birthday came, I ended up recording it. I recorded that song. He paid for the video. We dropped the video. Bro, I went crazy in Tampa, bro. Everybody remember this. I was going to Bartels. Um, I was in the seventh grade. No, I was in the seventh grade. No, six, no, I was in the sixth grade, going to the seventh grade, and we dropped it. Seven, like in the middle of the seventh grade, man, I'm talking about the reaction was like crazy. So from there, man, I was on it. I was on it ever since then. But like I said, around like my 13, like that was when I, my first song, ever since then, I ain't stopped then. For sure. Like, like I'm, I'm heading on, I'm all the way in. Like ever since that first time or I recorded that first song when I was 13, bro, I ain't stopped since then. Like, I knew what the goal was going to be. <laughs> 